Well, today is the day that the New Mexico State men's basketball team has been waiting for all week. Seriously, the Aggies had a double bye as the number one seed in the WAC tournament and found out they would be playing Grand Canyon in the semifinal round of the WAC tournament. To Las Vegas, Nevada, we go. Aggies and the Lopes in the semifinals. We start off in NMSU. Mike Peak, check this out. Slams it right over. Aggies go up 2013 early on in the first half. But GCU, they're in the spot for a reason. Gabe McLaughlin. Another dunk, that would cut the deficit down to two, but Teddy Allen for the Aggies has been big all year. Finds Mario McKinney, McKinney with the vertical, insane vertical right there. Aggies go into halftime up 46-37. Teddy Allen, 25 points on the night as a tough floater goes in, and you know another guy who had 20 plus points, Jabari Rice. Check this out, turn around, off, the, excuse me, right in. Rice and Allen combined for 46 points on the night, but GCU would battle back. They cut the deficit down to seven points there by a McLaughlin three-pointer and then less than 30 seconds to go Blackshear misses the three-pointer but Chris Mc McMillan with a putback dunk the Aggies would lead only by two 71-69 but New Mexico State would hit some clutch free throws down the stretch and get the 75-70 win and advance to the WAC tournament final which is a game that NMSU has had their sights on all year. I'll tell you tomorrow night, we're not here for nothing but to win it. Being second's no fun. We did that last year, and uh, we got to get ready to go. NMSU will play in the championship game tomorrow against the winner of Seattle U and Am or Abilene Christian at 8 p.m. This will be NMSU's fourth WAC championship game as uh, under head coach Chris Jantz.